Hi my beautiful souls, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to be diving deep into the world of hair coloring do's and don'ts. So whether you are a seasoned pro or first timer, this video is going to be packed with information and tips which is going to make sure your hair coloring experience is a success. So sit back, relax, grab a drink and let's get this started. So first let's talk about do's. Before diving into any hair coloring experience, make sure that you do a patch test. This small step will ensure that you do not end up with any adverse allergic reaction and your hair color turns out just right. So all you need to do is stick a bit and apply it behind your ear. Leave it there for 24 hours to check for any adverse reactions. So guys, next up is gonna be do choose the hair color which is gonna be right for your complexion and also for your hair type. So we all want a hair color which not only complements our feature but complements our skin tone effortlessly. And with the advancement of technology, this has never been easier. One fantastic tool I highly recommend is the Garnier Virtual Try-On Tool. This innovative online tool allows you to virtually try on various hair colors from the comfort of your own home. So simply upload a photo or, or open up your camera and start experimenting with the different shades to see which one suits you the best. And this is how I stumbled upon Garnier Color Naturals and the shade Caramel Brown 5.32. This form rich hue not only complements my skin tone but also helps in adding a touch of sophistication to my look. Plus the nourishing formula of the Garnier Color Natural ensures that my hair stay healthy and vibrant even after coloring. So guys, all you need to do is mix the developer milk in the cream colorant. You need to make sure that you are taking both of these in equal quantities. The pack also comes along with the gloves and manual instructions. So make sure that you go through it properly. And once this is done, guys, give it a nice stir. And if you have shorter hair, you can even keep it for the later use. Now guys, let's move on to the application. Do follow the instruction carefully. It comes up with the instruction manual and apply the hair color evenly from root to tips. Sectioning your hair can make this process much easier ensuring thorough coverage. Take your time, don't rush the process guys and trust me, your hair will thank you later. After you have let the color dwell up, for 30 minutes, it's time to rinse it out. Do use lukewarm water or a color safe shampoo to gently wash out the product and follow up with the nourishing conditioner which comes up in the pack itself to lock in the moisture and keep your hair from looking luscious and prettier. Hi Shivani, how are you? Hi Ritu, I'm good, how are you? I'm good too. I wanted to show you my hair transformation and I just got my hair color so I just wanted to have your reaction. So what do you think? Wow, dude, it looks amazing. Which color is this? This is Garnier's Color Naturals. I loved it, I loved it. I to link it. But I'm really confused that this one is looking better than the first one is looking better. So what do you think? You like it? You like it? Does it compliments my skin tone and everything? Do you feel good? Yes, this is good. Okay? Yes. Can we talk about disaster in the style? No, right now. Right now, this is all I needed. I'll, I'll call you later, okay? Okay. Bye. 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 Done, done. Bye. Hi, Rishali. How are you? मैं भी अच्छी हूँ। मुझे मैंने ये हेयर कलर कराया था और मुझे तुझसे पूछना था तुझे कैसा लगा? I was just looking at your hair और ये कुछ अलग लगा मुझे बहुत अच्छा लग रहा है। कैसे किया ये कलर? Like which is the shade by the way? This is caramel brown. Even I tried a trial last month, but somehow I feel like it is not suiting my complexion. So how did you get it? Like like it goes. Get the right color. Yeah, yeah. So there is this application called Garnier Virtual Try On. So you can try different different hair curl try kar sakti hai and then you can pick and choose whatever goes with your skin tone and with your features. So I have done it. No, no. I have done it at So there is this pack you need to buy and in 30 minutes your whole look is going to be changed. So it works like that. Wow, wow. I, I would, I'm looking forward to try it here. Yeah. And it's not expensive also. It's not, it's not at all expensive. So you can try it and see it. Arishali, bye. I'll call you later, okay? It's, it's okay, it's okay. I'll call you later. Bye, bye. Thank you. Bye.
So now we are going to be moving on to don'ts guys. Now speaking of damage, do not overdo with the bleach. Yes, it can be a powerful tool in lightening your hair color, but it can cause potential damage if done incorrectly. So always follow the instruction carefully and consider seeking professional help in case of complex hair transformations. Lastly, do not forget to have fun with temporary hair colors. Temporary dyes are a fantastic way to experiment with your hair color without commitments. So whether you are rocking a pastel pink for a music night or a mermaid blue for a night out, temporary colors offer endless possibility. And there you have it ladies, our hair coloring do's and don'ts guys. And remember, hair coloring is all about self-expression and embracing your unique style. So go forth, unleash your creativity and let your color shine. Until next time guys, Make sure that you check out Garnier's Color Naturals. You're not gonna be disappointed. The link is in the description box below.